Welcome to Night Prayer, or Compline, for Saturday, March 21st, 2020. Also, the Lesser Festival of Thomas Cranmer, Archbishop of Canterbury, Reformation Martyr, circa 1556. Almighty God, grant us a quiet night and a peace at the last. Amen. It is good to give thanks to the Lord, to sing praise to your name, O Most High, or to herald your love in the morning, your truth at the close of day. We will now sing the first and last verses of hymn number 565, All Praise to Thee, My God, This Night. All praise to Thee, my God, this night, for all the blessings of the light. Keep me, O oh, keep me, King of kings, beneath thine own almighty wings. Praise God from whom all blessings flow. Praise God all creatures here below. Praise God above ye heavenly host. Praise Father, Son, and Holy Ghost. Let us confess our sin in the presence of God and of one another. Holy and gracious God, I confess that I have sinned against you this day. Some of my sin I know, the thoughts and words and deeds of which I am ashamed, but some is known only to you. In the name of Jesus Christ I ask forgiveness. Deliver and restore me that I may rest in peace. By the mercy of God we are united with Jesus Christ, in whom we are forgiven. We rest now in the peace of Christ and rise in the morning to serve. A reading from Jeremiah, chapter 14, verse 9. You, O Lord, are in the midst of us, and we are called by your name. Do not forsake us, O Lord our God. A reading of Psalm 4. Answer me when I call, O God, of my right. You gave me room when I was in distress. Be gracious to me and hear my prayer. How long, you people, shall my honor suffer shame? How long will you love vain words and seek after lies? But know that the Lord has set apart the faithful for himself. The Lord hears when I call to him. When you are disturbed, do not sin. Ponder it on your beds and be silent. Offer right sacrifices and put your trust in the Lord. There are many who say, Oh, that we might see some good. Let the light of your face shine on us, O Lord. You have put gladness in my heart more than when their grain and wine abound. I will both lie down and sleep in peace. For you alone, O Lord, make me lie down in safety. Into your hands, O Lord, I command my spirit. Into your hands I command my spirit. You have redeemed me, O Lord God, Into your hands I come. 
command my spirit. Glory to the Father and to the Son and to the Holy Spirit. Into your hands I command my spirit. Guide us, waking, O Lord, and God us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Now, Lord, you let your servant go in peace. Your word has been fulfilled. My own eyes have seen the salvation which you have prepared in the sight of every people. A light to reveal you to the nations and the glory of your people, Israel. Guide us, waking, O Lord, and guard us sleeping, that awake we may watch with Christ, and asleep we may rest in peace. Hear my prayer, O Lord, listen to my cry, keep me as the apple of your eye, hide me in the shadow of your wings, in righteousness I shall see you, when I awake your presence will give me joy. Be present, merciful God, and protect us through the hours of this night, so that we who are wearied by the changes and chances of life may find our rest in you, through Jesus Christ our Lord. Amen. <clears throat> and now, as the Savior has taught us, we are bold to sing. Our Father in heaven, hallowed be your name. Your kingdom come, your will be done on earth as in heaven. Give us today our daily bread. Forgive us our sins as we forgive those who sin against us. Save us from the time of trial and deliver us from evil. For the kingdom, the power, and the glory are yours now and forever. Amen. Now in peace I will lie down and sleep. You alone, O God, make me secure. Let us bless the Lord. Thanks be to God. May God bless us, that in us may be found love and humility, obedience and thanksgiving, discipline, gentleness, and peace. Amen. <clears throat>